patients come in and they're scared and they have a diagnosis of cancer, it's nice to be able to tell the patient that the treatment's not gonna be too hard. So superficial radiation is a type of radiation which the dose is distributed to a very limited area right around the tumor and right on the surface. We can use that to eliminate skin cancers in lieu of surgery or sometimes after surgery. With our previous technologies, we'd probably end up treating the majority of the nose, even though there may just be one small spot on the side. So we'd first identify the tumor, which is done by the dermatologist. We would measure it, and then we would come up with a custom field size. Maybe it would be the size of a nickel. In the actual treatment, it would just take a couple of minutes and is painless. And that's the only part of the body that gets exposed to any radiation. Typically for this outpatient procedure, patients will come in to the office for about 15 minutes a day, five days a week, and it's often completed in two weeks. After they finish the treatment, they need to be diligent about putting some lotions on the skin. We expect the cancer to be gone about 95% of the time. Providence Swedish Cancer Institute is involved in many innovative therapies, particularly in my department in radiation. There are numerous things that are not done in too many other centers that we've been doing the last couple of years. Our older technologies, which we've been using for the past 20 years, were quite effective at treating the skin cancers, but at the same time, they really exposed a lot more normal tissue than we preferred. And this new technology lets us do the treatment in, I would say, a much safer way without compromising the efficacy at all. It's great to be able to help people. They come in with a problem, they come in with a diagnosis of cancer, they go through treatment without any problems, and then they're cured, so it's hard to beat that.